In southern Indiana, this latest winter weather event canceled class for high school students. But for university students, today turned out to be a day to brave the cold. Yes, it's what everybody's buzzing about in our Southern Bureau. News 10's Eric Stidman talked to some students about their on-campus commute. For broadcast student Olivia Williams, spring break can't come soon enough. That is, if spring break ever shows up. She split between several buildings on VU's 160-acre campus. My longest walking time would be from Davis to uh, Humanities the Humanities Building, which takes probably about five minutes. Challenge accepted. We put on the GoPro and headed for class. The trip took about five minutes, and even with gloves and a hood, it still felt pretty cold. So what are students doing here to beat the freezing breeze? Most of the students out and about on campus today say they're layering up gloves, shoes, socks, and anything they can find to stay warm on that short commute from the dorm to class. Oh yeah, I got one, two, three, I got shorts on under this. Oh, uh, they're bundled up in double layers. They have scarves on, maybe two hats, two pairs of gloves. They're keeping warm. I have five shirts on, and I also have two pairs of socks, and I also have my jacket, which is a double ski jacket, but I'm still not staying very warm. And just like you would expect, students say they'd rather stay inside. My teacher's been here for like 37 years, and he said they have only canceled school because of weather-related things like maybe once or twice since he's been here. So I can't, kind of think it's ridiculous that we had class today. For Olivia and her campus mates, spring break can't come soon enough. In Vincennes, I'm Eric Stidman, News 10.